this is a question which pops into my head every now and again. Do people need to lie? Or a related question, could society actually function in the absence of lies? Why do we lie? Simply, we lie because we're self-interested creatures. Could you imagine a world without lies? A world where it was impossible for anyone to deliberately deceive anyone else. No falsehoods, no deliberate untruths uttered. Take the world as it is now and then try to imagine that for some reason, all of a sudden if you like, people just couldn't lie anymore. What would happen? Would it be easier or more difficult to form relationships? Would the world be more or less violent? What about privacy and protection of self-image? How would they be affected in a world where truth was the only option, so to speak? Would a world without lies simply lead to chaos and the breakdown of societies? Or would a new order of things emerge? Would we adapt and survive or would we perish? I'm finding it difficult to imagine a lie-free world, to be honest. I find my brain is straining to get a good clear picture of how it would work. Then again, I can't imagine a world without humans, so I suppose in a way I really can imagine a lie-free world. But back to the title question, do people need to lie? Well, we don't need to lie in the same way we need to eat or sleep, do we? Like I said, people lie out of self-interest. Although not all deceptions are selfish, of course. But yeah, those everyday lies are about self-preservation maybe trying to please others or trying not to offend others I suppose society really is held together by lots of little lies maybe lying is instinctual but that doesn't mean we need to lie it is possible for a person to train him or herself to be completely honest. I believe that, I really do. Now, could a 100% completely honest person fit in and be respected in society? Well, not everyone respects complete honesty do they and as far as fitting in goes well I don't know you tell me if you want to be a more honest person in your day-to-day -day dealings you've got to start thinking long term at least that's what I found Think about what your ultimate goals are the next time you're tempted to deceive someone. A person can become a habitual teller of truths for the same reason a person is a habitual liar. 
namely self-interest. Sometimes lying is the morally right thing to do. Throughout history people have told lies in order to save the lives of the innocent. And in some circumstances telling the truth can be morally reprehensible. Life's not as simple as good e truth equals good, deception equals bad, you know? Society is a playground of lies and people being economical with the truth, shall we say. Maybe it's more pervasive than most people think. Lying, I mean. I heard a professor at the University of Massachusetts called Robert Feldman once say, we use lies to grease the wheels of social discourse. It is socially useful to tell lies, he said. Maybe he was right. Generally speaking, deception is viewed as immoral or distasteful. The philosopher Immanuel Kant said that lying was something that was always morally wrong because it corrupted the most important part of being human namely the ability to make free, rational choices. Now, I don't agree with Mr. Kant. I could easily destroy a man by telling him the truth, or save his life by telling him a lie. I could use the truth to steal away a man's freedom, or even his sanity, perhaps. But anyway, personally I think society would be better off, or more efficient, if you like, if people were just more honest with each other. One thing that's really annoyed me for years, and continues to do so, is people worrying about offending others by speaking their minds. And I'm talking about putting forward beliefs and ideas here. You should not be afraid to put yourself out there and take the hits. Don't be afraid to be honest. The truth matters. I don't mean to sound preachy, but that's the truth. So, to bring this ramble to a conclusion, um, a few questions for anyone watching this. Do you think society could function without lies? Are you someone who hates being lied to? If so, why? Is it a loss of autonomy or a loss of trust issue for you? Or are you perhaps someone who has a sneaking admiration for the art of deception? I'm not, but that's just me. I'd be interested to hear what you think, so by all means post comments and express yourselves. 
and I will see you later. Peace.